evangelist Gabriel Fernandez and God has called and commissioned me to lead people of all walks of life to a deep and genuine encounter with Him. By the grace of God, I have seen many people touched by God in this ministry and I encourage you, my dear friend, to connect in faith. Believe and you shall receive in the name of Jesus. Welcome, 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 my dear friend, to yet another video proudly brought to you by GFM United Prayer and Revival Ministry, the ministry that aims to take you closer to God. I'm Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez, and I'm so happy to be with you today on this special day. It is indeed the day that the Lord has made, and it is Sunday. And on Sunday, we usually pray Sunday deliverance prayers. My dear friend, I'm here to pray for you today that God will meet you at your point of need. Whatever it is that you might be struggling with, God will deliver you. Whatever it is that you're trusting God for, God will give it to you. Whatever it is, as long as it's in line with the word, you shall receive it. But most of all, if you're being held bound in any way, God shall deliver you. You shall be set free. The anointing of God is present and it's available over here. And the Bible makes it clear that the anointing breaks the yoke of bondage. Wherever there's any yoke of bondage, it shall be broken today even as we pray together. My dear friend, trust and believe. And even as you connect in faith, you shall receive in the name of Jesus. In saying that, take your cell phone or your device. Go somewhere private where you can pray. We can seek God where nobody will disturb you. And even as you go there, just begin to lift up praises to God. Tell him how much he means to you in your own words. Father, you mean the world to me. You mean the world to my dear friend. Father, you are our God, our God in whom we trust. We just here on this special Sunday that you've given us and we are here to praise and to seek you, Lord, because we believe that deliverance comes from you. You are the God who liberates us. You are the God who sets us free. When we find ourselves in bondage, it is your power, your divine ability that sets us free, especially for your children, Lord. Lord, you are the one who comes through for your children. Lord, where would we be without you? What would we do without you, Lord? Where would we go without you? Lord, today, I pray that you will touch and change the life of your child. Take your child to a deeper level with you. Do what only you can do in the life of your dear child, Lord. And we just give you all the praise, Lord, and we thank you. Thank you, Lord, for everything. Thank you, Lord, for the things that you've done in your dear child's life. And thank you, Lord, for the things that you continue to do. Lord, continue to touch and bless your child and take your child to a deeper and greater level in you. I ask this in the name of Jesus, and I thank you for it, Lord. Amen. My dear friend, lift up both your hands and say, Holy Spirit of God, come and touch me today. Even as I pray together with Evangelist Gabriel, I ask you in the name of Jesus, I welcome you in this place. Come in your glory and fill this place. Amen. Hallelujah. My dear friend, the presence and the power of God is here. Now we're going to begin to pray. But as we go into a time of prayer, I want to encourage you to do three things. Number one, comment in the comment section and agree with me. There is power in agreement. Number two, if you've got a private prayer request and you want me to pray with you and for you, I want to pray with you. Simply go to my website. Go to www.gabrielfernandezministries.org and click on daily prayer list. Fill in your prayer request and click submit and it's going to come through to me. The third thing, my dear friend, if God has done something in your life, I want to hear about it. Simply go to testimony, go on my website, go to www.gabrielfernandezministries.org and click on testimony or click on testify. Tell me what God has done for you and click submit, it will come through to me and we might even post it up. But in saying that, let's go into a time of prayer, my dear friend. Father, I pray, Lord, as today is Sunday and on Sunday we usually pray deliverance prayers, knowing that distance is not a barrier for your presence and for your power. Lord, I pray that you will deliver your dear child who's watching this video. Deliver your dear child right now, Lord, by fire and by force. Wherever there's any evil that has tried to hold on to your dear child, deliver your child, Lord. I ask this in Jesus' name. And I give you all the praise, Lord. I give you all the honor. I give you all the glory, Lord. For you are good and your mercy endures forever. Your mercy truly endures forever. Lord, touch and change the life of your child. Set your child free from every chain of slavery and bondage. Wherever there's any spiritual cages holding your child back, let the doors of those spiritual cages swing open right now. By your power, by your deliverance working power, 
by your wonder working power. Do what only you can do in the life of your dear child. Touch and change your child's life. I ask this in Jesus' name. In Jesus' mighty name. My dear friend, Jesus has given us authority over snakes and scorpions. He's given us divine authority to trample on snakes and scorpions. In the name of Jesus, we can cast out any evil spirit that comes our way. So right now, I command every evil spirit that is affecting you. I command it in the name of Jesus to leave now in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, I bind you up, evil spirit. I cast you out by fire and by force. I decree and declare, wherever you've been limiting the child of God who's watching this video, you shall limit the child of God no more. In the name of Jesus, you shall limit the child of God no more. I put a stop to all your work in the mighty name of Jesus. And I cast you out right now by fire and by force in the name of Jesus. Right now with the power in the name of Jesus, I release the higher ranking warring angels of God to surround the child of God watching this video. To surround and protect the child of God watching this video. And I decree and declare, wherever you are, you evil spirit, trying to attack the child of God, you shall not manage to do so anymore because you will find a hedge of fire around the child of God and over the home and around the home and around the workplace and around all the property of the child of God watching this video in the name of Jesus in Jesus name my dear friend I want to tell you something there is power in the name of Jesus but in order to release this power you need to believe believe as though you've received and it shall be done for you it is already done it's a done deal what are you trusting God for? Mention that thing and say, it's done. It's done in the name of Jesus. Wherever I've been struggling, say this. Say, wherever I've been struggling, I am free in the name of Jesus. I'm free from all evil. I'm free from all bondage. I'm free from all setbacks. I'm free from all limitations. I'm free from all demonic bondage. Just begin to confess it. Confess your freedom. Say, I am free in the name of Jesus. My life is free. I'm set free from all evil. I'm set free from all bondage. I'm set free from all setbacks. I'm set free from all satanic or witchcraft attacks in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. Say, no longer shall the devil limit me. My life has been opened up from this day onwards to full potential in Jesus' name. My dear friend, God said it. I believe it. And that settles it. Until we meet again tomorrow for another video that will bless and change your life. From myself, Evangelist Gabriel, Shalom and goodbye. If you were blessed by this video and you'd like to give a seed, feel free to do so using any one of the secured links provided in the description. If you would like to partner with us to support the work of the gospel on a monthly basis, then you can do so via Patreon. The link for Patreon as well as other information is also provided in the description. Other than that, my friend, God bless you, God keep you, God make His face shine upon you and be gracious to you. Until we meet again next time, Shalom and goodbye.